What's up everyone, Brian from GumballTech.com and in this video I'm going to show you something called Pro Switcher. It's for the iPhone and iPod Touch and I'm sure everybody who is watching this has heard of something called Multiflow. It's a $5 application in Cydia where you could have Palm Pre style um, application switching. Well, a couple days ago something called Pro Switcher was released. It's a free open source alternative to multi-flow that does basically the same thing but it has a lot of extra uh, customizable options that you could do so let me show you show it to you real quick once you download and install it it's just this little icon right here it has the picture of a of the contacts application on there so you tap that and then you could view your applications in your palm pre style you can also have the dock show up if you'd like. Then you double tap on on a on a card to bring it up. So that's the one of the dozens of ways to actually activate it. And then there is a settings panel in the default settings app where you could change a bunch of different things, like swiping to close. So if you bring it up, you could swipe somewhere somehow okay so yeah to swipe to close I guess you use two fingers to swipe down but you'll just have to play around with these like you could turn the dock on or off you could have it show the little close button you could dim your overall background you could show the application title page dots show your default apps you could also change the background so that instead of showing whatever app or your springboard or something in the background, you could have it show uh, a wallpaper. Um, you could change your corner radius, taps to activate. So like when you're at a card and you want to bring that app up, you could either tap once or twice. I'm going to set mine to once. And then there's a bunch of different activation methods. Like you could push the home button twice you could push it once at the springboard and it'll come up you could also hold the hold the home button a little while I have mine to hold the sleep button because all of my other all, all the other activation methods are being used by something else like Kirike or whatever now what's cool about pro switcher is that if you change something you don't have to do a respring so it saves a lot of time so you could really customize the app to whatever you want it to be. Now there's other ones such as springboard icon pitch, pinch, so that when you pinch it brings up Pro Switcher. And two swipes should make it go away. Mm -hmm. So let's take a look at a couple, uh, a couple of the other other ways of doing this. Um, icon spread, not sure what that one is but you could do your status bar things but my status bar is already used up by SB settings and Q tweeter, so that's not really that good. But you do, but you can tap the the, the status bar twice. Let's test that out, and there it is. So that's another way of doing it. Now you could activate as many of these methods as you want. So you could do all of them, just one, or maybe a couple of them, like I have. So I think I'll stick with the sleep button hold and the spring ball, the springboard icon pinch, because those are both pretty cool. Let's play around with this a little bit more. Let's background some, some more applications. So I'm just going to open some things really quick and background them with the Kirike. And a couple more small ones. Alright, so according to Kirike, we have two, four, six applications backgrounded. So we're going to activate Pro Switcher and then see how everything looks. Mail, phone, backgrounder, calculator, my app, and black rain. So then I should just be able to tap on one, and you're there. 
Now, since this is supposed to mimic the, the way Palm Pre multitasks, um, to close apps, you can either tap in the X in the upper left corner, or you can just throw it away. Oops, hold on. Just throw it away. You sort of have to tap and hold on one, and then throw it away. And it's gone. So that was a quick look at Pro Switcher, a free Palm Pre style card multitasking modification for the iPhone and iPod Touch, and we'll be seeing you soon.